So many people ask, what do you do when it's so hot during the middle of the day in Samé in central Portugal? Today's video is sponsored by Skillshare. And keep watching to find out how you can take advantage of having a one month free trial, which will just be for the first thousand subscribers who sign up for it. Skillshare is an online learning community which offers thousands, literally thousands of courses to members in over 150 countries. With Skillshare, you can explore your interests, develop new skills, learn something new every day. There's something there for everybody and it's ad free as well by clicking on the custom code in the link below you can explore the wealth of courses in the skillshare online library for one month for free so I decided I wanted to learn how to do mosaics and work with tiles. I watched a 30 minute tutorial by Lisa Hall where she showed you exactly how to create a mosaic tile backsplash for your kitchen. The search features on Skillshare make it really easy easy to find a course that will suit exactly what you are looking for. Many years ago I used to work in a dementia care unit and it was the most, I don't know, soul destroying job ever. I mean it was rewarding in that you were helping these people but to see the state of confusion that many of them felt and how frightened they were, it was quite scary. So I do have a fear of getting dementia. So as some of you might know, my mother was diagnosed with advanced Alzheimer's last year. And to see how this person that you've known your whole life changes has been quite frightening. And so I've been doing quite a bit of research into dementia and what causes dementia. And I see um, that dementia is like the overall umbrella. There's different things that can cause it. You can have a disease like Alzheimer's. But there are things that speed it on a little bit, like nutrition is one of them, exercise is another. And so I'm so pleased that I've moved to the farm where I can now have good nutrition and plenty of exercise. The other two factors that can cause uh, dementia to speed up um, I think if you're going to get it, you're going to get it. But you can maybe delay it a little bit. And that is um, to keep yourself socially active. Because if you start uh, not mixing with people anymore and isolating yourself, you're not stimulating your brain in any way. And also if you're having yeah, a sedentary sort of lifestyle. So my previous job involved a lot of sitting because I was in admin. So there was a lot of, yeah, a lot of sitting. And then you get used to sitting and then you don't want to not be sitting. It's, it's... But the thing that, that is really important is to keep your brain active and this is where creativity comes in and this is where Skillshare can help you 
because I find that um, I'm creative every single day and I might be creative in solving problems or um, yeah, creative thinking or doing something creative. Um, so you'll see in this video how I will make a mosaic. But when you are creative, you are exercising your that brain. So it's not just like doing crossword puzzles or um, playing Scrabble. You are constantly letting your brain make new connections and new wiring, etc. If you stop being creative, you are going to stop making those new connections and I swear your brain will just shrink. So when I watch some of my videos, I can see that occasionally I use the wrong word um, and especially like the wrong preposition, which I would not normally do. I, I don't know. I'm hoping that it's not... Uh, an onset uh, or signs that dementia will eventually come. But they say that um, if you start forgetting words and start forgetting things, then you know what? You've got to fix your nutrition, fix your blood pressure, fix your exercising. You've got to do all of that because you can stop it from advancing rapidly. So this is the design of my mosaic table. So the design is done. The next step will be to glue down all the pieces and pray like mad that the dogs don't bump it and knock it over. But yeah, it's always good to be creative. Keep that brain going. As you can see, this is what I do two and a half hours later now i have to yeah as i said before glue this down and then grout the thing is you are never too old to learn new skills you need to keep learning all the time whether you are 20 years old whether you are 80 90 years old try and learn one new skill every single day and take a look 
at Skillshare and see what courses, I mean, maybe you can learn how to do, you can be 80 years old and learning how to do watercolors. You can be 90 years old and uh, learning how to do mosaics. You are never too old to learn. And if you want to stop your brain from shrinking, <laughs> then you have to try and do, learn something new. Keep your brain going. That's my little rant for the day. So in the meantime, keep safe, keep sane, and I'll see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.